when you're on race weekend, there are a lot of stuff to do. Even it's a different country, uh, the timetable is more or less safe. I'll try to, to train a little bit in the morning, a little bit in the afternoon. In the practice, I'm meeting, second practice meeting. That's how it goes, and then uh, so next, next day is the same story again. Because everybody does what, what they think is the best way. I do biking and you know, gym, different stuff. Well, I fancy uh, cycling and uh, running, and uh, I have to go to the gym as well. I do whatever I feel. Uh, you know, we are more on the upper side, uh, shoulders, triceps, uh, biceps, uh, trapezius, uh, neck, and the uh, abdominals are very important in case if you have any crash, you just keep your uh, internal body uh, safe. Well, uh, I think as a child I really loved the uh, Lancia Delta HF Integral, the rally car, the Martini car, and uh, hey, if, I, if I could own one I would love to have this one. I was first looking at the rally championship and uh, this car was drove by Didier Ariol and uh, it was a front runner world championship. I am not interested to put the horsepower in the car, so go and ask somebody who, who does it. As every child, I, I wish I could be a F1 driver when I, was, when I was a young. My dad was passionate about it and he brought me once to a, a race. I guess you always dream about uh, being from a one or, or have a S road. And I fall in love with his motorsport and then I try to go kart and I loved it and I just wanted to keep, keep going. So I say work at school and then you get the chance to race go kart. I did a lot of go karts before and then some. Uh, Racing in car racing in England and then end up in Formula One. It's not often that it will happen, so I'm not very happy to end up in.